we are wrapping up on a job the guys did today sorry for the generousness i was going to do a quick video of it and then upload it later I was like at hell with it i just want to do a quick live we're going to be done i'm going to be out of here the guys wrapped this up today i had some other plans going on so i couldn't uh, be here but wanted to swing by after the fact so i can get the trailer loaded up get it out of the driveway so we're not blocking the drive or the end of the cul-de-sac here do a quick final check <coughs> in my final check we're just looking for things like nails in the gutter, making sure they're all clean, making sure everything's good, checking random spots, nail pattern offset, making sure there's no nails in the keyway. You can tug on those, you can see it, give, you know. There's the sure nail, the Owen Corning duration. Oh, just a quick run over. I was up here already, got the trailer hooked up, making sure everything's taken care of pipe painted back gutter clean oh damn 11 of you on a saturday evening why are you all here gutter clear nothing in it anyway just want to do a real quick live i gotta get going i told my daughter's gonna beat her home not looking like it's gonna happen but she might be watching live right now so if so hi sweetie uh daddy's heading home guys wanted to work we had a job we had to work in today kind of a tight schedule so did what we could i'm just here getting uh, the trailer out of here figured i'd do a quick live because i haven't done a friday night live in a minute looks like we got somebody there brian Barr. what's up brian Barr? Ooh, nobody wants that close to me Whew, yeah getting some uh old grays coming on in here yeah Talking, but if you had that updated invoice with the duration shingles, yep, no, I'll get I'll, that to you. I'm gonna send it to probably my insurance if they need it. So. Yep, not a problem. I'll get that to you. It'll All probably right. be Monday though. Okay. All right, Good thanks. Work. You have a good night. Yeah, Sometimes the things that happen on live video. I really am trying to hurry to beat my little girl. All right, I got a few minute drive. Make sure we're good here. I ended up dropping the trailer off, getting it all loaded up because we couldn't get a delivery out because this uh, homeowner wanted to have theirs done on a specific day. Weather was an issue that day. We did our best to get it worked in. Weather, time scheduling issues that day. I asked the guys if they wanted to work Saturday. They were like, sure, let's do it. But I had some prior engagements like my big 4-0. So, not going to miss my 4-0 engagements. Yeah. Can you see the scruff? There's white ones coming in. We're getting old, getting up there. Over 20 years of roofing in the roofing industry, a huge chunk of that has been installing and management in the last six, seven years or so has been doing this for grand roofing. Whew, I'm winded, running around, checking everything, getting it all done, squaring up with the homeowner. By the way, okay, got it. Whew. So what did I do with the check? All right, hopefully you guys are enjoying your weekend with your family, and I need to focus on getting out of this neighborhood and getting home. So real quick live for you guys. Rich Smith, Brian Barr, Brian Barr, anyone else out there? Super Roof, are you out there in the, in the crowd today? Get my belt on here. Anyone else out there in the crowd notice uh, not just material increases if you're in the roofing business, but trash dump increases experienced a pretty significant one here recently uh 60 70 percent rather pricey 13 me on saturday i'm just blown away maybe i need to work saturday if you guys want to see a live let me know comment down below <coughs> i don't know saturday is really especially this late in the evening not a good day for me to work uh all right where are we at here four minutes really it's just i didn't want to leave the trailer unattended leave it out in the cul-de-sac get stolen it's happening actually a lot of there's a handful of people i know here in central indiana <clears throat> see if the funnel quit bouncing around the wheel where their trailers have been getting stolen right off the job site you leave it out too long people notice it i don't know if they just happen to drive by or they got bird dogs out there watching and then they call and say hey come get this trailer at this address um this came from the bmv here in indiana right from their mouth <laughs> acquire registrations on their trailers so people have been central indiana 
snag and trade sales. <laughs> Excuse me, sell them on uh, black market maybe, or just selling them outright, using them in the hills and the sticks. Not cool, especially because a trailer right now. I just bought one a few weeks ago from TC Trailer. It's like eleven thousand dollars between the taxes and uh, the trailer itself. So they've really gone up since 2020. It's ridiculous. I should have bought one years ago, but had to pick up another one for the fact that just moving equipment, uh, not one well, equipment, trailer material, not just trash, moving material logistically has been a bit of an issue over the past two years. So that's why I picked another one up, but I don't want to see it get stolen. You guys in the comments below, if you're in the, the industry, you deal with trailers, you heard anyone in your area having them getting stolen? If so, let me know where you're from, where you're at, where it's happened. I'll go just for a few more minutes here as I hit the west side. Thank you, Brian. Appreciate it. Oh, wait. Oh, with an I. That's the right way, too. Not with the old Y. My brother-in-law's name is Brian. The Y. It's not right. It's not right at all. Oh... 15 and 5. I don't know why I even say the viewer count because if I watch these back and be like, oh my god, 15 people, that's it? Brian Barr and Brian T. Oh, another one. Totally agree. That's right. Wise for losers. God, I need to get some air going in here. It was a really chilly day today. I didn't think I was going to get out of my hoodie at the house after lunch and I'm push them on the backyard bagging it for the dogs and I'm like oh I gotta get out of this hoodie got done mowing and enjoyed a nice t-bone steak dinner on the grill time with the family it's like babe I need to go get a trailer moved I love my wife the best if she's watching you're the best alright oh our parents know how to spell that's right Well, that's it. I just wanted to do a quick one. Let me know if you guys like it. The job we just wrapped up was the uh, <coughs> Corning Duration, supplied by Reese Wholesale. Got to give them a shout out here in Central Indiana, John Reese. And, uh, yeah, anyway, got to pay attention where I'm going here. Appreciate it, Brian T. Looking good for my age, though, right? You got to get close up to see the grays. Not too bad. All right, one quick uh, check of the chat here at the red light, and then I'm out of here. Getting ready to go green. If you guys like the live, let me know. I've been considering bringing back the Friday night live Q&A, Friday night chat, whatever. Just got a lot going on. And if you like the drone shot that I did the other day, let me know, because I was still at the job site, landed the drone, literally popped the chip into my laptop, uploaded it to the laptop, started quickly stitching the audio rendered it out got home to my abysmal 40 megabit a second upload which is really fast compared to what i used to have but still super slow compared to fiber if you guys like it give it a thumbs up i'll try to do more of it it took a lot that day not to mention getting soaking wet by that big red thunder boomer that moved in all right until next time be safe <coughs> we'll see you on the next one